simple? Are you trying to imply that a group composing completely of female animals will somehow magically breed? No, I'm simply saying that uh, 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 life finds a way. Welcome back to Kayfabe Science, the show that has a BS in BS Science. Hi, my name is Doc Ticka 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 Slim Davely, and today's episode examines the wonder that is the Poison Mist. The first wrestler known to have poison sprayed his opponents away was the Great Kabuki. In the years since, it has also been revealed that quite a few other wrestlers are actually capable of this remarkable feat too. But who are the top five to spit that hot fire? Dylan, 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 and oh yes, Dylan. Now you may be wondering, how exactly is this spit spat? Well, lethal lung butter is actually a natural ability, which can only be done by wrestlers who have evolved with a very specific gland. As proof of this, before the mist is sprayed, you can sometimes notice a mister warming up his throat before a spit take. This works the glandular muscles that are required to produce the mist for maximum release. Now, how did these wrestlers become so fortunate as to be gifted with this ability? Well, while the Great Kabuki may have been the first to use the mist, the wrestler to popularize it was the Great Muda, who is, of course, the Great Kabuki's son. So now we know that hawking a harmful lugi is in fact congenital, with only a small portion of the population being able to pass on the necessary genes. Furthermore, wrestlers are not the only ones to possess these glands, and nor are these glands a new phenomenon. In fact, they date back as early as the Jurassic period. Hang on, because I'm about to blind you with some science. As as we've learned from the motion picture Jurassic Park, the Dilophosaurus sprays a poisonous solution in the eyes of its prey in order to blind them. And the Dilophosaurus attack is surprisingly similar to the way that wrestlers use the poison mist as well. The most popular mist, the green solution, temporarily blinds opponents obscuring their vision, leaving them vulnerable to attacks just like with the Dilophosaurus. And while this might be the mist in its most common form, that is not to say there aren't plenty of other variations to boot. The red mist burns the opponent because the red mist has a much higher acid content and works to inflame the highly sensitive eye area. Then there is also the blue mist, which is capable of putting a victim to sleep by using the hormone melatonin, which is created naturally in the pineal gland. And a more recent discovery is that of the yellow mist, which is a powerful neurotoxin that has the ability to paralyze an opponent for a period of, of time by causing particular muscles to stop functioning. This is similar to the venom of some forms of spitting cobra. And finally, the most similar to Dilophosaurus venom, the black mist. This is not only the most similar in color, but it also has the most similar effects. Now, while the damage of the mist may vary, the black mist is definitely the worst mouth juice we currently know of. The black mist has also been said to be capable of causing permanent blindness too, being extremely painful, causing retirement from pro wrestling, and even, possibly, the permanent sleep. Taking all the effects of the aforementioned mist and dialing it up to 11. Fortunately though, the black mist appears to be the rarest form of throat secretion. Oh, and it should also be noted that not all wrestlers who possess the ability to spray one form of fatal phlegm can necessarily excrete all variations. However, some wrestlers have been known to team up in order to combine efforts so that way they can mix their mist to create all kinds of combinations of different effects. Oh, and if you want to point out that there is no proof that the Dilophosaurus actually had this ability, need I remind you that this is a fake science show for a fake sport, so uh, don't be such a f***ing nerd. <laughs>